Alright guys, how's everyone doing? We picked up a few extra tapes. I saw this. This uh, premium razor edge professional samurai made by a bear. So made by the same manufacturer as this guy here and this one here. So this one is about three times the price of this one. Uh, off the top of my head, I can't remember how much I paid for this. I'll put it right here, price, bing. Uh, and I also picked up this one, uh, green painter's tape. So these are all made by the same company. And this one, so I expect them to do a little better. The only thing we're not gonna test here today is how long they last for. If you can leave it on for two weeks and pull it off and that's all right. Pretty much as soon as it's dry, I'm gonna peel it off after one or two coats. So we're not gonna be waiting around that long, but we should be able to tell. So I'm interested to see how these go. Me personally, I haven't even used these yet. I haven't even used these ones yet. So this is the one that I traditionally use. It's 10 bucks a roll whatever I said before and very expensive just wish it was cheaper but we've been using it a lot lately and this is the reason why I'm doing this I've got a project coming up where I'm gonna to need to buy a lot of this tape so whatever I don't use today I will be using um, on one of my next jobs but I just want to know if I should go out and buy all of this or if I can get away with it and just buy some of this stuff you know for a third of the price so I'll leave a link down below where you can buy all of these off Amazon quick shipping and uh, let's get started let's check out the surfaces that we're going on today all right guys here we are nothing pretty but we're gonna get the job done here so these are the surfaces that we're going on today we've got fresh glass board it's not painted, maybe I'll give it summer coat and then we'll try it again, but we'll see. We've got some Perspex here, fresh Perspex. So we're gonna try that on here, we'll even try some on here. Uh, we've got some corrugated iron, do a few strips. And we've got this chair here, I'm gonna paint this chair. While I've got the sprayer out, I've got exterior paint, so we'll see how nice we can make it. We'll do one color, blue, say the top blue, and this uh, other Tuscany kind of colour for the chair part. And we'll, what we'll do, we'll tape up along there, tape up the top and try to make it nice and neat. Maybe we'll tape up the edge and see if we can get that perfect with our tapes, which is the best tapes. And we'll try to do it as, as good as we can. So let's get started. Alright guys, so we've got all our tapes here. Let's put them out. Put them to the side. We have paint here got something to open the paint with. What I have here is a Graco sprayer, handheld sprayer. Graco Ultra. Um, it's an airless, what you do, you squeeze the air out like that. And it's a handheld airless. Very good, why I like this gun is because you can spray it upside down, don't lose any pressure. It's very easy, comes with removable cups. I'm still on my same original cup. As you can see, I've used it quite a bit. See, here's all the other cups it came with. Haven't even needed to use them, haven't needed to use spare parts. I've used it quite a bit already, so I definitely rate this tool very good. Even you don't need any other extra tips, this one works just fine. Very easy to operate, and you'll see in this video how to operate it. You'll see I've got other videos, uh, which I'll link to right here. Why I like this is now I have this, I wanted to get one anyway, but now I have this. Now I'm with DeWalt, so I can get any DeWalt tool. So that's really good. I like the brand DeWalt. Let's get this ready first. With this, you don't need to thin any of the paint down. Let's start sticking this tape down. Let's open this tape up. That's probably what we should do first. Number one is this bare tape. So we're gonna stick that.
That's super easy to do this. Okay. Breaker sprayer. Oh, look at that. That's gonna be nice. So there's two ways to fill this up. You gotta pull this off. Or you can just fill the cup up and leave this part on. Normally I leave this part on when I'm using it, when I'm topping up. not need to thin this down so this is good totally recommend this product we don't even check the batteries on this thing one bar should be all right click that in Notice I have this open. Just want to squeeze it. So all the air's out, and you can see it in this chamber. Close it. Is it ready to go? First, this way is the spray, this way is primer. And that's priming it up. Flick it back, and it's ready to go. I'm going to leave a link below. We can buy these pretty cheap on Amazon compared to Why don't you hit that like button and subscribe? That'd be great. When we season the other side, yeah.